Hi everyone, I thought I would do a very quick video today to show an item I recently bought. I want to say bag, but it's not really a bag. I've got the curtain up again so that it replicates a studio environment, just a really poor one. Um, but it, it helps with the light a little bit. So I've got this here. I've already opened it. Um, it arrived yesterday or the day before, so it's not an unboxing per se. So, this bag, bag, necklace is actually what it's called. So this is the part of the heart range. Fall in love, is that what it's called? I'm not actually sure. I think it's the, called the fall in love bag or range or whatever. So this is actually the necklace version of it. So I'm just going to try and push down my screen there. So this is actually, yeah, this is actually the necklace and it's purple now my camera is not very good it is showing it as like more of a lilac color it's a darker purple than it's actually showing on camera so it and it comes with the like old hardware so i think this cost two thousand pounds great british pounds for anyone who's <laughs> not from the uk um yeah or, or approximately and I think the the belt I'm not sure the belt bags like a few hundred more and then the clutch on chain is again a few hundred more about two and a half and then the jump to the large size that's four thousand and eighty I believe so this one actually isn't on the website I was actually struggling to find some information on it the first time I heard about this one the fact it even existed was when I was in France looking for them and of course they're sold out everywhere there and a lot of places had this this version used to be of the necklace. And I was like, I really don't want that, that's shit and pointless. And then came home and I was like, yeah, they only had shitty necklaces and now I have one. <laughs> so anyway, um, at some point I think I've been brainwashed by social media. Um, no, you know what? I saw someone wearing one as a belt and it didn't look much smaller than the belt bag. I thought, actually, yeah, it looks okay. Anyway, so I'm going, I'm, I was going to put it on there, but what I'll try and do is show the size of it. So it's really tiny. Um, now... I don't, I don't even think it fits a card. If you want to take like your bank card out, you can't. You can't wear your bank card around your neck. It's unfortunate actually. So yeah, it doesn't fit a card. Oh, but it will fit a toothpick. That's quite tight, but it fits. And then, yeah, you're kind of out of luck, really. I think it would fit those AirPod things that people use. I don't use them. If you use earplugs, it would fit earplugs. Probably, like, just headphones if you had the... No, actually, head, head, the headset. But if you had, like, the, the wire ones. And this, which has been sat on my table for about, about a year. If you like to carry your soy sauce around, then it will fit. It will fit. Um, what else? Yeah, I don't really have much else sitting around here that I can actually put in. So this is like a, a lipstick. I mean, it's unused, but it's... Oh no, this is a purse spray. You know, whatever it is, it won't fit. Um, I'm trying to look for like a lipstick, but I don't actually have one. Here's something that's like lipstick size. It's a, it's a pillow spray. If you want to... Some people go for naps in strange places, so you could just ch -ch, go for a little nap. Oh no, you can't because it doesn't fit. No, it doesn't fit. And actually, I don't know if, how this compares to like lipstick. Maybe if you had a slightly shorter lipstick, it could fit. Anyway, so what we have established is this doesn't really fit very much. Maybe some coins. So I think that if you're buying a necklace in the shape of a bag, it's more of a gimmick. I don't think you're thinking, right, I'm going on a night out, take my keys, <laughs> take my cards, my coin. You're not probably not doing that unless you know, you lack a brain cell or two. So, I will try it on and show how... So this is a normal necklace. This is like regular necklace. You can't fit anything in here. No, it doesn't even open. Uh, so this is it here. So I'll try and... I'll try and kind of move back. So, I'm not wearing a brilliant outfit, I must admit. So it kind of, like, here's my belly button. It kind of goes down to your belly button. I, I don't know, I find it as well, like, kind of heavy. I can't, I just can't really imagine, like, wearing it for long periods. Yeah, it's kind of heavy. So, um, I was 
practicing wearing it different ways before this video in front of the mirror. Now, I must say that um, this does not appear to be adjustable unless I'm just a bit stupid. Like I can't, I, I think it's stuck. I think this is a fixed chain length and I think it's just fixed. And, well, I, I can't see a way to adjust it. So before you attempt to do what I'm about to do, make sure you're not too big because you might snap the chain or damage it. So I'm, I'm kind of borderline. So I'll put it over like this. So I thought potentially it could just be worn like kind of like this. And certainly for me, this is comfier. And I know this is a bit of a recent craze where bum bags, belt bags are worn just across the chest. It's not going to work if you've got a bust. It's not going to work if you can't actually get it over your head. You don't want to get into a position where you're stuck and the fire brigade has to come and release you from a Chanel necklace. So, um, yeah, so I, I think for me, this is actually okay. I quite like wearing it like this. And for me, it actually takes like the, the weight off my neck. It's not super heavy. I just, yeah, I'm, I don't find it overly comfortable. And you can't fit much in. But if you were going to put in something a bit heavier, like batteries, I don't know, it would just add a bit of weight. So for me, this is actually a lot more of a comfortable position. Now, the other way to wear it, and where I've seen influencers, people online wearing it, is around the waist. Again, only try this if you're sure that it can actually fit over. Or if your bottom half is smaller than your top half, you could step into it. So, I tried this before, so I can do this. But maybe not everybody can. So, this is it, like, around, like, I'd say, like, my true waist. So I think it actually looks quite nice. Now, it can be dangled lower, so, like, around the hips, like this. It could be put, kind of, you know, at the side. You know, you see, you can see belt, but I don't know how this is looking, or you, you can really see that well. Um, yeah, it can, it can be used, basically, as a belt bag if you can get the, the chain over your shoulders or over your or pulled up over your bum and um, which i guess some people might not be able to so it really depends i'm actually going to take it off to see i don't have very wide hips so i assume it's going to fit past so um i think if you were doing that you would probably need depending i mean i think if you can get it over the top half or the bottom half it means you're quite slim and that this is going to be too long for your waist or your hips so I think what you'd have to do is get those uh, clips that you can get online that people use for shortening their strap lengths on wallet on chains or mini bags but i do think it does look quite good like that and i think it looks quite good across as a necklace the jury's out i'm not so sure i'm not so sure also i'm not wearing <laughs> the most flattering outfit so i suppose it might look a bit nicer than someone else with another outfit on now can you double it up i've not tried this i'm not going to try it in case of, like i get stuck um you could probably shorten the chain if you had those clips to get it to sit a little bit higher i'm just going to pull up like this to show um aesthetically i just don't think it looks as nice as a necklace it kind of looks a bit um just a bit random really i prefer it the other ways but it doesn't look bad and it might suit somebody else more and these ones are more readily available than the the belt one the small no the clutch with chain or what i call the small and the large they typically all seem to be sold out and these ones are a little bit more readily available um, which probably means you'll have the option of getting the color you want to so this is the purple and i think that's it really i don't really think i have anything else to say i got this one from harry I think they still have some available. If this review has really sold it to you, feel free to contact Harry.